Besides that, beyond that, the internet is, is that. It's, it's a system bound by standards and policies. Now, if I could bring back my digital host, Vicky, she'll be introducing our next speaker. My <laughs> Good evening, everyone. And uh, it is indeed a uh, pleasure to see everyone here, especially the internet pioneers. Uh, you know that even 20 years ago, it was actually named the first email conference. As Dr. Rudy Villarica mentions, it's, it was the first and the last email conference. Why was it so? Can you imagine 20 years ago, the only thing people were thinking about was to connect or communicate via email. They had no other thoughts of, did they imagine Instagram? No. Did they imagine streaming video? No. All they wanted to do was do email. There were already systems at the time, find the for doing email, but they wanted to connect to this thing called the internet. Within the past 20 years, we've seen a whole, whole raft of applications float over the internet. Not just your normal applications such as Facebook or Twitter, or even Instagram. We have medical informatics, we have uh, remote medicine, we have uh, businesses, many business processes that now run over the internet, including, for example, our now almost uh, an iconic business process outsourcing industry. Now, when you think about it, uh, policies and regulation of the internet. The, the very simple fact of the matter is that the internet was largely unregulated 20 years ago and even today. 